Unit integrity damaged. I don't think these PPN pistols are going to do the trick. Not much choice. Captain Elazar will want to speak to you. We only recently learned you were still on the station. Dr. Igwe is blessed. It was fortunate you came along when you did. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than any of us.
No movement. Room secure. Chief Elazar will want to talk to you. God, watching those things move makes me sick. What is it doing? Oh my God, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things, like it, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. Ugh, corpse, maybe. Oh, I don't know, maybe. maybe it saved him. It could still be Enoch. Does it look like it, Sam? Promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now, I'm going to check the perimeter. Requesting new operator. Star Pyramid 490 Medical Class Operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical can handle. This won't take long. Good as new. You can fill out a service questionnaire at the front desk. Whoops. If you find a way out of here, take Dr. Igwe with you. Maybe he can be of some help. Morgan Yu. I'm surprised you escaped Simlab. Yes, I knew about that. 
I checked the shuttle logs when the rumors about you being demoted started circulating. All I found was you checked into the sim lab but never signed out. Not sure you could, but it seems you've escaped. Just like these creatures of yours, the ones your brother said couldn't get free. Wish I had better news. We're holding out here, but just barely. These standard-issue PPNs might as well be cap guns for all the good they do to those things. Only way back into Talos is through Cargo Bay B, and that's locked tight for our safety. And yours. You want the code? Help us fortify things here. That means eradicator turrets, and lots of them. To do that, though, we'd need fabrication plans and a working fabricator, and both of those are out of reach at the moment. The fabrication plan is in the safe in the security office, but the hull breach puts it out of my reach. Still, if you have a suit and are up for another walk, we could really use the additional firepower. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember, the only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive. Any luck with those turrets? Dr. Igwe figures he'd survive. Dumb luck, I suppose. Don't know if Wiggy, er, uh, Dr. Igwe is lucky to be here or not. These trans star people let you know before I do it again. Show. Please do. do. It's only polite. <laughs> All right, turrets. I'll be back to check on you. Thank you, Al. Morgan? I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transtar mounting a rescue operation? I was in fuel storage when... when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But they weren't running from the fire, it was these shapes. I had contained the fire and I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those things. Everyone I worked with, they're dead, aren't they? I wonder if one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? Morgan, I heard you put out the fire. That was... that was very brave. Thank you. I wish I'd been able to, but those... The what? I don't understand. It's just a saying. It, it means, uh, are you doing okay? Oh, I am, Officer Rose. Al, thank you. Good to hear it. Officers collected those supplies. They're not for you. The fire kept me from reaching the power supply. But now that you've put out the fire, we have a chance.
Power circuit checks out, and fabricators online. You did it. We're not done with you yet, so get back here safe, all right? Hey, are you there? Chief? Yes? Is there something wrong? I wanted to speak to you about the most recent VIP visit. Leitner, the pianist. Chief, if there were any problems, I checked the schedule, the roster, I did my best to make sure Igwe wasn't too... Igwe. Chief, I even had Leitner's cigarettes waiting. You did an excellent job. In fact, Leitner praised you specifically. <coughs> There'll be a bonus for you in your next pay cycle. Take Nicole out for a nice dinner, all right? Yes, Chief. Thank you, Chief. <laughs> <laughs> 